What's going on guys welcome back to another video and today's video I have a poor little Galaxy J5 2015 over here and today's video I'm going to be showcasing the Lineage OS 15 aka Android 8.0 Oreo on this well if you're asking where is the installation video I will not be making as this is still not stable like there is no camera working so there is no voltage and stuff working and in today's standards if the ROM doesn't have a voltage it's not stable at all yeah that's how people think so I'm not going to show how to install this ROM but how it works surely so let's just boot it up so I have not done the setup so let's just do it let's go skip setup as new skip like all of the stuff is working but not stable as you can see it just crashed over there it didn't happen before but it does happen when you install gfs with it next next more agree and we are done android 8.0 oreo on your j5 2015 i mean i have another device with android 8.0 oreo for example u euphoria which has the same chip and more ram than this thing but over here the audio just runs much more smoother than that thing which is a extremely nice thing as you noticed over the camera just disappeared because it doesn't work it was just a dud app here you have your normal setup there are no apps added over here as the official lineage os is still not released but you do get your music 11 and recorder which uh, work too yep the recorder has been updated with the recording screen so initial impressions as i said before extremely smooth you can go to wallpapers there are some lineage OS wallpapers over here let's just try this one extremely cute let's just go to the menu let's just hop into the settings there you go apps open fairly quick for this little puppy scrolling down go into the system about phone there you go android 8.0.0 like watching this phone running like android lollipop over here to the android oreo three years later is just amazing Thanks to all the developer support, here is your quick settings panel, now everything is white. If you scroll down, you have new animation, then again you have your normal toggle, so here, pretty nice touch. You have Wi-Fi and all other stuff working. Let's go to the battery, as you can see battery has an all new UI. Also the battery drain is quite good for initial builds. Go into the display, you don't have anything else besides the live display. You have screen calibration which does work. Cause AMOLED can't actually produce pure white so you can use that. Then you have display size in 3 as this is a very small display like 5 inch. Go into the storage as you can see the UI is a bit different. Yeah, it was not before I don't know it's a weird glitch in Lineage OS 15. It happens to many devices but there should be a huge circle and an option to free up your space. But I guess after installing the G apps it just disappears cause it was there before. Scrolling down you have GPS and all other stuff working too. Let's just disable that to save power. Let's just enable developer options and check whether we have the all new GPU support or not. You get this Kia renderer but there is no Vulkan. I guess that's only for the Android 8.1. You do get some development tools over here. Those who want to report bugs and stuff. And then you just have your normal apps. There is nothing much added over here. It's just your normal ROM without camera and Volti. So yeah guys that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one. Peace.